<clears throat> What's up guys, it's Hova here. Um, today I'll be telling you guys how to um, upgrade your phone to iOS 5. And basically um, it has to be working with Jevy SIM on T-Mobile. And I'll be demonstrating on how to basically do all this uh, with the little time I have. So let's get, let's get started. So I have um, my iPhone here iPhone 4 um, it's now being updated to iOS 5.0 and um, <clears throat> this is my um, T-Mobile SIM Jevy SIM not the Pro the regular Jevy I just kept these two in case backup I needed to activate iOS 5 because um, you will need the AT&T SIM cards to activate it it doesn't have to be, val it doesn't have to be um, valid working AT&T SIMs to be regular AT&T since and um, I am using this great tool great website which uh, I have to give a shout out to my man MK321024 for uh, giving me this website <coughs> he actually has a video on YouTube you can check him out subscribe rate and also my man Lightspeed who is actually a big hey helper guys, big helper here um, because because of him we're able to do all this um, first thing you have to know is in order to get this done you must have your UD ID registered with Apple which you have to get done if you have a developers account which costs about 90 about 99 bucks um, you know, a group of people have uh, set that up and um, if you guys are interested you can always um, hit up my boy Lightspeed um, on Twitter his uh, L-I-T-E-S-P-D 69 and um, donate 10 bucks I believe and um, he'll give you, he'll get your UDID registered instantly. And I see my as well be able to do it on a PC because based on the website we have here, you can use step these step step by step instructions on a Mac, on a Windows, right? Either or. And this is where you go to download your iOS also, the beta version. And most importantly, you have to download iTunes version 10.5, which can be attained through this website. <clears throat> um, right here, and uh, the iOS is right here. So two things you need um, is the iOS five firmware downloaded and the I, uh, iTunes five ten point five beta. And this is a great site to get at, and that site is techstuffs.net slash all that. I'll post it up below in my YouTube video and all this. And um, just bear with me a few minutes. I'm almost done. It's almost updated. Use iOS 5.0 on T-Mobile again. I repeat, iOS 5.0 on T-Mobile because we all know how to update to iOS 5.0. But I'll be showing you how to update it as well as use it on T-Mobile with the Jevy SIM. And you can do this on the Jevy SIM Pro. I have not done it. I don't have Pro. I have the regular first Jevy SIM that I bought for like seventy odd dollars first day it came out and uh, there's a lot of stuff going out now with the Jevys, a lot of fakes you have to know how to identify the difference the main di one thing I can give you is um, this tool right here this black chip has to be really thin and small the fake ones are really thick so that's the only way we can identify them once everything else looks the same it comes with the same tray also so it's Jevy and you just put your Jevy on top first and T-Mobile SIM card on top of it and I just wanted to make sure also um, that you guys know I do believe I am the first one to get this done on um, iOS 5.0 because I have uh, speaking to a lot of friends um, on real life and on my app called IPTT which we get on and uh, we discuss situations on a daily life basis about iTech stuff so I believe I'm the first one to get this done. I uh, may be wrong, but uh, as far as my knowledge, I'm in the first one. And uh, there you go. Sorry about the video quality; it might be not that sharp, but it is like what 3:59 in the a.m. here, so I'm trying my best. Alrighty. As you notice, I did take everything out. I want to show you guys step by step. So those of you guys that are stuck. Can use this video as an instrumental. Well, we gotta wait some more, I guess. Let's pull up our iTunes. 
that's one cool feature that I have on my Mac boom mm -hmm. and um, I believe uh, it's done I heard, I heard vibration going on and uh, my phone is loading and this is the message we're waiting for sim card is not installed excellent so and we get that message on our phone also so we are officially on iOS 5.0 guys what we're going to do now is grab our AT&T sim and put that in because we have to get in and activate the phone first now again I repeat the sim can be valid it can it could be an active sim or it could be a voided sim it really doesn't matter you just use whatever's comfortable to you or whatever's available to you at the time but you can see I'm using the AT&T sim putting it in there and um, okay slide to unlock follow these instructions and we lay that down there and we're going to choose English obviously we will speak English here uh, actually no the one for the country my bad where is the United States okay click next Okay, log into the Wi-Fi. Just lock that in. Okay. So got the Wi-Fi set up. All right, and we click next. Now this is, by the way, guys, the new way iOS 5 runs. This is the setup. No computer needed. Um, this is all happening via the iPhone, not the iTunes. Remember the I used to be before. So, just letting you guys know how cool the iOS 5 is. I'm really psyched about it. I know many people are. And now it tells you how do you want to set it up. So we'll just do it as set it up as a new phone since we're not really going to go into details now. And you're going to have to log in with your Apple ID here. And um, let's just fill that in. Alright, finally. Created the damn ID here. So we're on five, iOS 5.0 right now. We updated it using iTunes 10.5 beta. We have iOS 5.0 here, and um, as you can see, we're just getting started. Okay, we're gonna set all this up. And uh, okay, set up email. Uh, optional. Skip. We're gonna skip this. And we're going to be like automatically sent, no problem. And start using iPhone. So, guys, just want to show you. This is our iOS 5.0. You guys can see it clearly. 5.0. Right. And we're going to be using the Jevy Sim now to do the magic. And I'll show you how to do it. Just give me a sec. Okay. So we got the AT&T out. We got this. I wish I had a tripod. Alright, so got that there. And put that so you guys can see. It's the Chevy Sim Care. Okay. Jet sim tray, then the tray, and then the sim. Guys, there it goes. Boom. And we're going to be getting some messages soon, so get ready for it. That bar will come. We'll be getting a search button. 
and the button, the message you'll be waiting for it's the accept button voila accept the button the message says actually uh, should have kept it there but wait for the bar for to go one signal and then get on the phone and dial and wait like 15 seconds actually after the one bar comes up which is axed so about let's say okay five more seconds five four three two one okay and then you dial one one two press one one two dial and you're supposed to hang up after two seconds so one two done boom and then go to settings turn airplane mode on sit for a few seconds till the message comes up and we should have it guys iPhone 4 on iOS 5 um, currently not jailbreakable jailbreakable but unlockable with the Jeffy Sim so just want to show that to you guys boom voila now all you have to do is turn it on uh, turn it off actually sorry turn it off okay press ok to that and then wait for that signal to come over T-Mobile which will be coming up real shortly searching no problem just gotta give it some time about that okay boom there you go guys there you have it T-Mobile just have to be a little patient with these things because if you're not you will not be able to get this done it says you can may charge you okay no problem just to prove to you guys again I am dead serious this is T-Mobile iOS 5 T-Mobile iOS 5 whatever baseband it is on doesn't matter now because we are unlocked and just want to show you I want to uh, call 611 uh, let you guys hear it it is T-Mobile alright guys hope you have enjoyed my video today I know it's pretty long thank you for your patience and what we learned today a quick recap is iOS 5 on iPhone 4 not jailbroken on T-Mobile via the Jevy SIM. We need two tools, a valid AT&T SIM, a valid Jevy, either Pro or regular. I recommend the regular because that's what I have. But if you get to Pro, you can use the Pro. Um, I haven't used the Pro yet. And these things right here, which you can get on my link I will post, are the 10.5 10 Beta iTunes and um, iOS 5 ISPW Beta 1 you can get from this website which I'll post and again I want to thank you guys for your time please rate comment subscribe and have a nice night